I still have that get some hot egg, 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 egg valentine action on my uh, IRC. My number of viewers just like doubled for some reason. I'm gonna keep the Mega Man 9 splits up. Two is the worst. That's the one you absolutely need to figure out how to have concrete for. Yeah. Oh, I forgot that this changes my swimming entirely. Can I get oh. over? Can I get over? If you game over, you gotta fight all the robots again. <laughs> I mean, at least I have them. Yeah. So that Y was the B button, and I forget on this. No, my B button's the B button. My stream is going on a little while longer. I'm probably going to make my way up to Jabu Jabu's belly. Yeah. There is something very weird about bottomless pits when you're swimming. That's true. It's like you literally have the item that lets you swim at the floor of the ocean. Come on. Enjoy that. Yo, hello everybody from Handsome Jackass's stream. Welcome to Casual Zelda. I'm doing a lot of saving and quitting in this dungeon, actually. I'm going to jump out of the call, too, I think, unless people want me to stay in here. 
Yeah, same here. I'm gonna head out. Thank you guys again. Good night, everybody. Thank. Thank you. Do this again next week or something. Several times I've gotten to uh trying to play a bunch of Zelda games. I hit this point of the end of ages and I just get walled. I feel like the last time I beat this game was actually when Twilight Princess came out. Like, it's a good game, but, like, the end gets a little ridiculous, and the Game Boy's... The Game Boy's save functions backfire on you when you get to the end of the game. Um, you kind of get stuck having to uh, save when you save and quit right you respawn in like the last cave or something you entered and the way the last dungeon was put into the game like it's like a normal cave so you end up saving at the very top so you'd have to fight your way all the way down and that's where I just got walled If I had potions and stuff in that save, it'd be fine. Plug the thing.
Let's see. I'm actually, I'm vaguely aware that I'm starting to get myself in trouble here, but I'm out of trouble as well. Okay, I knew this dungeon was almost done. That's part of the reason I said I'm going to just keep going. I meant for everybody else, though. Manic, well, Manix is one of the admins. The pixels for Peace Marathon, what are you doing that? Submissions in this upcoming weekend, not today, but the next weekend. And yes, it's at the end of February into March, raising money for Save the Children. Yes. like Ocarina of Time made it so that every Zelda game needed to have a sneaking section. Oh my goodness. You don't have to give everybody a game if one of those games is X7. Yeah, I need to just go. I love how like nobody pushes the switches back. Extra deep water to make sure you have this tail for no reason. They literally have a whirlpool full of bottomless pits as a secret passage. How does Ralph plan to get through this? If he knows about this, shouldn't he know that it's like a complete like deep water? Or does he secretly have a mermaid suit? Can't unpush the switch.
Did I just accidentally stumble into the correct path? Nice. seeds here though. We could have done it, but I guess they don't want to kill anyone. Despite the fact we're rampaging through the, site, the countryside, ruining the Octorok uh, family tree forever. the harp around at all anymore. One thing that would have actually worked nicely is if the uh, other tune activated the portals in the present so you didn't have to like switch back and forth all the time. How are you going to get there, Ralph?
rats inside a fish. Alright, so we did that. Jabu Jabu is next, and I completely forget how to get in there. I mean, I know the general area of the map it's in. ring at all. Sword beams. I think the sword beams might be the best one. Let's use Pegasus Seeds forever. I think actually this sh this store has a piece of a heart for sale of all things. I'm going to do it from here. There's a lot of things that, like, Game Boy games could use as quality of life things. One of the best features of the Link's Awakening remake is a dedicated sword button. And, like, dedicated all those other thing buttons. Uh, I'm gonna get this. Because I'm never gonna get 500 gold. Gold? Rupees? I have things, I swear. And after this, we go see how far we can get into the ocean in the next 20 minutes or so. I have no illusions about finishing anything the rest of the night. We're going to go as far as we can. Can I wear more than one ring? Actually, level three, I think. Man, when you walk 
walk outside of your house, just watch out for the time port. That one. problem with the quality of life options on the original Game Boy is you're dealing with an NES controller. A, B, start and select. If you don't have those, well, sorry. If I come here in the future, there's like nothing here.
assumes like the other screen too, but... What's up, X Dragon? Welcome home. I guess. Eyeglasses eye. How about them, Jeeves? That game was ridiculous. Wait a light. But what about the Texans just choking, though? Not being able to do anything in that game. stuff going on back over here. It's, it's just how do I actually get moving on this? I very much want to go and buy the... Uh, oh, thank you. Thank you. 
haven't been in the direction of the witch's hut in how long? Someone down here has got to know what's going on. Water's too shallow up there. We can't. We can't surf. Did the Packers win? The last time I checked the score, there were like two minutes left, and the Packers were up by five or something, and they had the ball. But that could be a situation where the Seahawks were ready to pounce. I don't know. They finished the job. Okay. Medicine costs 300 rupees. <laughs> I guess that's all I needed to actually get in. Because my sword button keeps just switching around on me.
Yeah, watch out for those two seeds. That's what we learned today. Because they show up hungry. Granted, come on, Houston. <laughs> what was that? Both teams had garbage touchdowns, and so it's like, what happened? since I saved you 400 years ago. I think this game has a 400 year gap. This game is basically like just pop to the the opposite age, and everybody's like, yeah.
you imagine? We absolutely need the fairy powder. Sorry, you don't have a, you don't have that book. Literally everything in the ocean is dying. Game Boy cutscenes, let's go. Sentry. Having this on a button that's hard to unequip is really bad.
polished for many years, it says, but I mean... We're still in the past. It doesn't make any sense. And polishing an iron shield doesn't give you a... Polishing wood doesn't give you iron. But whatever. somehow. Although I guess, in theory, that could be not your shield. Since you don't necessarily need to have a shield for that to be, uh, that thing to be there. Tokai. to be clear now. I can't remember where I'm supposed to go. for Jabu Jabu anyway. So yeah, I'm gonna appraise this ring, enter level seven, and then save and quit for the night. Thanks for watching everybody. Figure out who we're gonna post here. Zelda Randomizer Weekly is going on. That's a weird flag set. Uh, I think Darkwing Duck is actually playing it. As is Fred. Our host DW. That's a good one to have. Cause I'm pretty sure that makes it so... Uh, sword bubbles don't affect me. from Iron Shield makes some sense because an Iron Shield that gets used later. It's at this point just they're naming things. Wind Waker had the Mirror Shield after this, so the Mirror Shield was still a thing. Those eyes are just as surprised as the rest of us that there's an essence of time that grew inside a fish. It's also kind of weird that we're like... This is... We, this game ha is one of those, like, there's two water temple type games. You have this dungeon, but you had a mermaid cave before this.
long shot in here, or am I getting... just to hold it up. I feel like this is a dungeon where we do adjustments of water levels eventually. Level 2 Power Bracelet is not actually a dungeon item, is it? Blocks may or may not dissolve in water. So my only path forward is through the yellow tiles over here. Actually, no, I can still go up from here, can't I? The yellow tiles you can go up. Uh, you can go up a level. Um, signs that the long shot is needed soon to really feel like trying to do anything. Breath of the Wild is an excellent game, you should play this game. Yellow time. Like seriously, what does it mean if your guardian fish is actually a dungeon? I mean, I guess it's cool that it holds a sacred treasure that is needed to save the realm. But like, really?
all the way down, I think at the right side of the room that has the giant, the diamond block in it. Don't do game. Just why game? Because I can just walk over the spikes. Do we have the ring for that? That's actually good. I was running out of those. reading. Look, oh no, it can't be done. to a boss room. For some reason I think that room I saw earlier with like the chest in a weird spot is actually the boss key. I wasn't even paying attention to if uh The, the compass lit up for it. And yet it's this one. I'm postulating it's that one. So I need to get... What's a... Circus from below.
is that room, right? Yeah. The enemies like finally respawn in here or something? This is the this is no, this isn't the entrance, but it's almost the entrance. So this is gonna fall like a tile or two short. stare at the, the random hookshot block, but I can't actually do anything about it. Take that step to the right first. Mm, that's definitely a ring. shot.
didn't try that door at all. That's probably actually the long shot. So I need to get into the bedroom. Fairy. Like, I thought I washed my hands, and I can still... I'm pretty sure there is some jalapeno on my hand. So every time I rub my eye, it is a disaster. It was like a little bit, like a couple of years ago, where jalapeno was really good to me. And right now, it's like... Uh, Oh, it's because that block, that whole block floats. That's what it is. I'm trying to remember, did you figure out why that worked? Why those gold block platforms look weird? And why they're special? Long 
shots in the water temple. Fred. the job of flooding this place. Who thought it was a good idea to have to like mash left and right?
guess I have one key, but I don't want to get that one down by the entrance. Part of what made the original Water Temple in Ocarina of Time good was once, it was if you had Din, uh, Feroy's Wind. Feroy, whatever. Feroy's Wind. You could basically teleport around to checkpoints. Which made backtracking to hit the switches that much easier. Wow, oh, I just lost two hearts to a uh, Maldor. It feels like. And show me some hearts. Show me some hearts. The big switch. Compass, and I thought the boss key itself was supposed to ping. Oh, do I have to hit both blue switches? Is that one? I thought I would just hit that one, and that would be it. that I hit it. I'm pretty 
sure I have to uh, go over to that one other room. stuff is just here to mess with you. joke after all this is that I still haven't seen the actual path to the boss door. Like, I've seen the door, but I've not seen anything resembling a path to it. So is that cash, or is that a ring? I think that's gotta be cash, because it's just kind of out there in the middle of nowhere.
get wrecked, Water Temple. Last one is. Actually, take a break to actually watch Mega Man Nine stuff. Soon. I'm actually pretty hungry. Let's see what do we got going on here. trying to get inside these whirlpools at this point, which is presumably through that tunnel, which I think involves the, the power bracelet and that weird cave. Save 
actually. I haven't saved the whole time I was doing all that. I can appraise two rings. If I get a ruby or a duplicate, I can appraise a third ring. I, I don't want a duplicate, though. Two anyway. It's not a bad one, honestly. This will be in the same spot. I got the chest already.
sure. We're off the holodrum. higher up in the future. It's like everything else in this game like, moved over time.
Liebe Fan.
dungeon. Seems pretty pedestrian. Mm-hmm. 
He's actually putting in work. dungeon where they actually do prove they want you to walk on the red blocks because you can make this jump I'm so glad they actually like made this an intended mechanic does look kind of green. What's up, ghost? Thank <laughs> you. 
strong feeling I'm not supposed to leave that screen. I guess I can use a uh, the shoot the pea shooter and get this though. Um, it's going. We're into level eight, so I'm almost done. We actually are starting to get to the point where it's an actual question. How do I get out of here? Because I'm starting to think the answer is save and quit. Lots of walking in here. Because I just shouldn't have pushed that block. No, I'm just back in this room.
do all this in reverse then. Once you make one misstep, the whole thing just falls apart and the path you had just disappears. I don't know why, but a Wiimote Plus seems to just drain batteries for no good reason. By through its sheer existence. First foray into the fourth basement, or I guess it's the third basement, it's just the third floor. Fifty-five rupees, let's go.
job game. We're at that point in the run where I need to know where it is. I'm running to more and more things that are basically... Do you have power raise at level 2?
this. This key goes. I've seen that locked door too many times. Honestly, I probably unlocked the doors out of order. Be that way, video game.
Hell yeah. And so if I go left first, I have to go left twice. Which means I have to go down and right before I do anything. I could do, use that to get around this whole set. That sets up some awkwardness. When I have to get back over there to the left, I might be able to duck in there. That means I have to figure out how to circle those. Okay. Oh, I have to finish in the top right. had to see the room. Power gloves. We've got gauntlets. Actually want to go that way and like that that's a convenience at this point I mean, this dungeon decides like as you open it up to be like uh yeah yeah we can just get that to you well after the point you actually would have liked to have had it
mean, I know I have, like, the access to that room now to just go downstairs normally inside the vlog. But I can also do this. two-ton statue on Red Wiz Rope. Red Wiz Rope says, shrug. makes a platform appear. Is it really as simple as I should have tried to, uh... Simple as 
taşır gamma. You know, I'm sitting here trying to figure out how to get into into the extra room down there. That's where the essence is. Can't get in there just yet. Or at the very least, there's a very very deliberate path into that room. Nintendo boss number five! Climb the tower.
probably the blue ring. I think I can use this even from this side of, of history. And I think the game just knows these map tiles just don't do it. Yeah. The graveyard is time locked. That save button. I got like the big rupee earlier and I have no idea how that how or why that happened. Like there's a part of me that strongly suspects that was not luck. And that spot on the ground was actually just programmed to have that.
up. The internet suggests I just dig. of buying a potion is based on how many hearts you have. But I, I just need more money.
harder than the Goron one. seeds.
does not work. Got this.
to you, Mr. Owl. past the door of time for
got one more, right? Trash can. Cool. Is there, 
that's what our, that's what Coach Carlos always said to do. Bang on trash cans for no reason. At least until the umpire was for no reason. Got the ball, so we can play catch again. I don't have a trash can here, but We got the link statue now. I'm just still gonna say thanks for the raid. Now I can play Oracle of Seasons. play the damn thing. Why are we training Ralph? I mean, Ralph got through the final dungeon without any key items. Like, he didn't have the secret thing to undo the magic. He didn't have essences of whatever. He just got through it. He's obviously a god gamer. What are we doing here?
playing to the end for no other reason. What is nose take? Forget deer force. What's nose take? Honestly, I just want the code because I'm going to use that for seasons, which means I'll have a blue ring in seasons. I'll have four rings and a I'll have four hearts and a blue ring to start seasons. That's actually not bad. I think I get the shield to start too. Even though there was exactly one dungeon in this game where I actually needed the shield to uh, flip spinies. Yo, shoutouts to the Super Mario Club. These crowds seem to go, I'm hungry. Question mark. To be continued. 